Going home in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> Mrs. Milk. Chime. <laughs> oh, Jack, how am I going to sleep tonight? Peacefully and alone. <laughs> Are you drunk, Ryan? Uh, yes. I am drunk with the spirit of the wee folk. They're all around gathering for St. Patrick's Day. There's hundreds of them right here in this room. <laughs> they're coming to take me away tomorrow. Oh, it's a nice enough hospital. I'm so happy I get to leave. And there's a party at the Ryan's every March 17th. Green clothes, green food, a few green faces as the evening wears on. You'll love it. I'm, uh, I'm not exactly one of the wee folk. You, uh, you sure Italians are allowed? Everybody's allowed. But you are specially invited. Okay. When, uh, when you go back to the family, the job and all the rest, I uh, want you to have this. A going home present? Present. Partly because you're well and uh, mostly because I'm beginning to understand how much I love you. Hmm. Kind of afraid to open it. It's not a ring. Whew. <laughs> it's more. It's more than anything I'd go out and buy for you. Go ahead. Open it. Oh, Jack. Your medal. There was a man once sent from God whose name was John. He's yours now. Honey, um, I can't take this. It's part of you. You're part of me now, too. Wear it for both of us. I will. Thank you. Hi, Bob. Hello, darling. Hello there, Jack. I brought these things for the morning. I think there's everything that you want. Oh, wonderful. Oh, we're all so excited. Even little John knows his Aunt Mary is coming home. He keeps running into your room to see if you're there yet. I'll have to bring him a present. <laughs> Can I show Mother? Of course. Jack's given me something very special. Oh, it's lovely. It's a St. John the Baptist medal. Mm -hmm. Such a patron saint. Mm -hmm. And a, a particular friend of Sister Mary Jo. Ah, <laughs> she's the nun that raised you. She gave it to him years ago, not long after he was brought to the orphanage. Well, He's worn it ever since. It must be very precious to you. It is. Well, I'd like to meet St. Mary Jo <laughs> one of these days. I think you'd enjoy each other. <laughs> sleep, dear, sleep. <laughs> well, be easy. <laughs> Night, mate. See you tomorrow. <sighs> I love telling her. Mm, wonder what she thinks. That you must love me a whole lot. It's more than that, you know. Mary, I want to say that the medal's a promise to you, but that's not quite true. It's more of a hope. I don't know how to explain it. You don't have to. I know. If you were the kind of a man would give a ring to the woman you love. Or if you were the kind of person who'd get engaged in the classical sense, then that's what would be happening now. Why can't I be that kind of man? Oh, Jack. Who knows what you'll become three months ago? You never would have parted with this medal. You loved me, but not like now. Not like now. That's what the medal means. You want us to be together, part of each other. But as long as possible. We're not talking about forever. Not yet. Ha <laughs> ha. You said that good. Oh, I don't want to sleep alone tonight. Me neither. Soon. <laughs> 